Hey YouTube, um, I thought I'd make this video today about a tool that I got here at my shop. Um, it's called the Mini Doctor 2 and it's made by Induction Innovations. This company is out of Illinois in the US. And the uh, reason I'm making this video today is because I had a customer earlier on uh, drop off an exhaust manifold uh, that he had broken a couple of bolts on. I'm going to show you that. I just thought it'd be a good uh, good time to uh, show how this tool works. So we had this uh, exhaust manifold dropped off earlier. As you can see right here, one of the uh, studs broke off into the manifold. And on the other side as well. And I'm going to show you uh, just how this tool works. All right, so here it is. Um, this is the case opened up. And this is a complete kit. And this kit includes several different coils and in different varying sizes. As you can see, I've had pretty good use of this tool. I've had this for about four years now. And it has uh, saved me a lot of headache, a lot of hassle when working on rusty and seized up bolts. Um, so in this kit, you get several pre-formed coils in varying sizes and a couple of unformed coils, such as this one here. You can unravel that and uh, shape it in pretty much any shape that you need it, you, you would need it for. There's also another one here. This is a U-shape. Um, this, this works great, especially if you're working on uh, doing alignments and you got seized tie rod bolts. Uh, and also works very well uh, when you're working near uh, uh, gas tanks or any kind of fuel sources. Um, so the basic principle behind this is um, you would plug this into it, your wall outlet at 120 volt alternating current. Um, and uh, you would take one of these coils and insert it into the electrode here. And I'm going to show you that. And uh, basically what it's doing is um, it's uh, the, the coil is converting the current uh, to a high frequency magnetic field. And uh, the magnetic field uh, is basically crossing the uh, work surface or the nut that you're using or, or you're trying to heat up. And uh, it's vibrating the electrons in the metal and through that vibration, the electrons dissipate heat. So that's the uh, principal theory behind it. Um, but I'm going to show you just basically how it works. Okay. So here we go. Uh, we got uh, one of the coils installed into the electrodes through there. And you would use these uh, thumb wheels here just to secure it into place. And... Uh, I'm going to show you on this uh, exhaust manifold just how it works. And as you can see, I have it bent like that just to give me a better angle here. That way I don't have to hold it straight up. So I hope uh, I can film this and show you at the same time. And there's the bolt. And the uh, power button is right here. You just hold on to that. And it's also got a fan at the bottom here. And you, oh, I'm gonna turn it on now. So as you can see, it quickly heats up the metal. Not sure if you saw the smoke there, uh, but this bolt is already pretty hot. And uh, we'll see in a moment here. I would say within the next 20 seconds or so, just how hot we can get this bolt. As you can see, it's already starting to glow. It's only been about 10, 15 seconds right now. And we got this bolt pretty hot already.
So within uh, about 20 seconds or so, we got that bolt nice and hot. As you can see there. Um, you can also do the same thing on the other side. It's also got a nice LED light so that you can see the area that you're working in, especially if it's in a dark area. And as you can see, within a matter of seconds, we got that bolt nice and hot there. So the best part of this is there's no open flame. So you can work pretty safely and especially around fuel sources like gas tank bolts. If you got any bolts on your gas tank that are seized up, uh, you don't really want to be using a torch in that area, especially if you're, not, if you're unaware if there's any kind of vapor leaks um so yeah this this is the uh mini induct induction mini inductor 2 made by induction innovations and it's a great must-have tool thank you for watching this video i hope it was a i hope i wish it was informative and if it was please subscribe like and share thank you and have a great day